My armpits feel sticky. <laughs> So, um, I went to Target the other day because I'm probably on a plane right now on my way <laughs> Honestly, I haven't even packed. I'm usually the kind of packer where I pack the week before and that's when I end up forgetting 90% of my stuff. Try not to stress and pluck all my hairs out I know that packing can be extremely excruciating for a lot of girls because I feel like I should pack for like five months before I go postal I got some last-minute stuff today at Target that I wanted to share with you guys I actually went to Seamox store. Actually, when I was at the Max store, the girl looked at me like I was the biggest idiot. Like I had like a mole growing out of my face with a hair on it. I told her that I needed to replenish my foundation, which is my Studio Fix fluid. But I couldn't think of them. You know when you have like a brain fart? It's a kind of fart that you can't squeeze out. So I was running around the mall, you know, all frantic. I was trying on clothes and leaders that I know. One of my eyebrows was gone. I had lipstick on my teeth. My phone strap was tangled to my pants. Like, have you ever just had one of those dates when a girl is on a mission for last minute shopping? You gotta do it. So I went into Mac the other day and uh, and um, I couldn't think of what I needed there. So I'm like stuttering in front of this girl. And I opened my eyes and she gone. I'm like, wow. I walked to the counter and finally got myself the Studio Fix Fluid. The last thing I bought. Oh, oops. <laughs> I was sitting on it. False alarm, Howie. When things disappear, I blame you, I know. This is a bad dog. Excuse me, don't step on my shit, okay? Okay, go over there. So I showed you guys this um, lipstick onto my Get Ready With Me Valentine's Day. This is my favorite, favorite go, uh, 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 this is my favorite lipstick of MAC in the whole, whole wide world, especially for my olive. It's the only lipstick that I will forever buy and I hope it will never discontinue. Ew, how are you here? A piece of dog hair is a nice little touch. So moving on to Target stuff. Got one of these goody goody 37 pieces. These are actually a really good deal now that there's hair all over it. If these were only actually like five dollars and you get 37 pieces. Do you remember when I had ombre this color? Ew! Oh, he looked like a rock star. I was planning to just kind of like touch up all the brown spots I see in my hair. So this is actually the brand I always used to use when I dyed my hair by myself, like at home and stuff. This is the ultimate black and I already have super black hair, but um, I got it for just touch up. And this one's for my hair extensions. I also got a month's worth of Man's Gillette Fusion Shaver Filler thingies. I only use a man's shaver because I got man hair as strong as man hairs <laughs> well I just think that like um, a man's shaver is much more powerful and stronger than you know a dainty little woman's shaver which is fine I mean I use that on my armpit all the time but for my legs I mean my hair is like a werewolf got one of these elf shine erasers they're only like a dollar super cheap such a good deal 50 sheets 100 sheets divided by 30 days um, let's just say two and a half sheets a day Whatever. So I was really, really pissed off that um, Target hasn't had my eyebrow pencil, the cheapy one that I use from the brand NYC. I went through different Targets all around. Hey, nobody got it. So luckily, one of my subbies who I saw at Target, who works at Target actually, directed me to a different kind of eyebrow pencil. I didn't get your name, I'm sorry. But I see you. And she gave me a sample. I didn't even know that they do makeup at Target. I got a full size. Black is black in Maybelline. This is the Lash Sensational. It's got a little curvature there. I don't know, I'll see if I like it. If not, I will use it still. Purifying Neutrogena Makeup Remover. It smells good. Oh, this is perfect because I need like some travel shampoos. Oh, Herbal Essences. Remember when like that commercial in Herbal Essences when the girl was like in the shower? And she's like, <laughs> bothering her hair like, Oh, oh, sorry. It was actually much more sensual or sexual than that. Howie Smith. Moving on, um, another mascara that I got is I'm back. The Lash Blast Maybelline. This is my favorite drugstore um, mascara. Oh, hey, I got it in waterproof. Okay, I've used this ever since I was 16 years old. I'm in love with the cocoa. I like cocoa puffs too, man. The thing that I love about the Lash Blast is the bristle. Um, the bristle is amazing and it can get like in like, you know, the crevices of your eyelashes. So since I probably will not be wearing a lot of foundation, I just got myself a tinted moisturizer. Um, you guys have seen me use this before. It's by Sonia Kashuk. I got something that's a little bit darker than me because I know I'm into anticipating to get dark and it just kind of like covers all like my blotchiness on my face discoloration or whatever I actually got my hair trimmed the other day um, you can't really tell and this one I accidentally sold in my yard sale and this is actually a really 
This is the Paul Mitchell Super Skinny. It's an amazing product. If you guys have ever used like It's a 10, it's kind of like that. But this one is amazing. The thing about it is that it's expensive. It's almost $20, but it's so worth it. And it lasts you forever. And I actually put it on my hair today when I straightened it. it just kind of gives it like a smooth shine. Did you see that? Okay, last but not least, I got myself a couple of silicone nipples no they're not silicone nipples they're just like um to cover you know the aerials just to be safe just in case my tanks are a little bit see-through so i got one of these um silicone gel thingies who has areolas that big <laughs> and they feel like ooh, they feel like gummy bears this is supposed to just cover the um, nipple area without hair on it it's just supposed to give it the illusion that um you don't have any dark mass on your breasts <laughs> And I got these because sometimes, you know, you can't wear a bra with like certain things that you wear. You gotta cover the girls and they sisters. I don't know if they're gonna work. I'm gonna test them out after this video. And I probably won't return it because it's probably gross. And they better not put it back on the shelf. Thank you guys for watching. Check out Hey Jermaine for more inspiration. And I will be taking tons and tons of pictures for you on my trip. I will see you guys soon.